What, what you doing, doing today, Nicole? Nicole? Okay, we Dex and I dug up some some recordings. Which one do you want to do first? Bunker. So, Larry, you probably heard me do it, but I did it once for a long time. It's a bit that I used to do, I would fly to fancy, that Jack Kennedy, listen very carefully, podcast people, Jack Kennedy and Bob Kennedy and Elvis Presley and Hitler have faked their deaths years ago. They are waiting in a bunker beneath Las Vegas, beneath a men's clothing store. They have a shaft elevator. And I think, and we'll see how far we go with it, but Elvis is, you know, he's kind of talking to Jack Kennedy and Bobby Kennedy's being bugged by Hitler and they're in the bunker and it's all about their interchange. And then someone <laughs> starts to come down the shaft elevator if we get that far. We'll just play a few minutes for you to see what you think. Ladies and gentlemen, Elvis, Bobby Kennedy, Jack Kennedy, and Adolf Hitler starring in <laughs> The Bunker. All riffed live, by the way, no script. Okay. Greifen und speaking und hatten freuten und brachen und speaking in alten. Come on now, uh, Hitler, I'll make you some peach cobbler. You don't have to get all animated about it. <laughs> I've got no problem doing that. Uh, 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 Elvis, um, would you uh, tell uh, Adolf uh, to uh, stop uh, staring at me? <laughs> Come on, Hitler, you know Bobby don't like it when you look at him like that. <laughs> Why don't you just leave him alone? I don't catch a word of that stuff. I, I can't figure what you're talking about. You got any of that, Jack? Um, I believe that he is saying that we uh, are not relating to him as best we could. Well, come on. How can we relate to him? He's 119. German dictator. Everyone thinks he's dead for 75 years. I know, but he was important to our mission. Yes, he is. Even though he stares at me and bugs me, I believe that we really need him. He's very important for strategic issues. <laughs> nothing of it, Adolf. I'll stand up for you, even though sometimes you're a bugger up my bug. Hold on a second. There, I haven't seen this. We've been here 50 years. There's a down button on the shaft elevator. Oh, no, that means we're found out and somebody's coming down. I don't understand it. Nobody could find that secret door in Nordstrom's in the second stall from the left in the boys' department. Ah, uh, something strange coming down. Everybody get ready. Oh, don't worry about it, Hitler. I know you got a little revolver. Get it ready. Get it ready. Load it up. And uh, you want me to do anything, Elvis? Ah, uh, Bobby, you stand over by the elevator shaft. Jack, you stand on the other side. I will stand on one side and Bobby will stand on the other. That's perfect. Whatever comes out of there, you start swinging like Kennedy. I'm telling you, make your daddy proud. I know he was a whiskey runner. And now you got to have some tough Irish in you. I believe I'll take down whatever comes out of that. Yes, and I will take down whatever he doesn't take down. <laughs> yes, Miller, and you'll take down whatever they don't take down. And all 700 pounds of me are going to be waiting over here. Whatever gets past them is going to bounce off me and bounce all over this bunker. I ain't got a chance. Whatever comes in ain't going out alive. All right, boys, it's almost here. Everybody stay themselves. Jack? I'm uh, very steady. Bobby? Yes, I'm uh, ready a bit, too. Adolf? All right, we're all ready. Here it comes. Third floor. Second floor. First floor. Ding. Well, hello, everybody. Ah, uh, I don't believe it. It's Cary Grant. <laughs> Cary Grant, what the hell are you doing here? You scared the hell out of us. I thought you were dead 20 years ago. Well, I'm not dead. I'm like you. <laughs> I found out about you from someone at Nordstrom. They'd seen Elvis in the dress too many times, and I started to think about it. <laughs> what are the odds that Elvis would be spotted at Nordstrom in the dress all these times? So I thought to myself, maybe Elvis and the two Kennedy brothers and Hitler are still alive. <laughs> Maybe they're in a bunker beneath Nordstrom's plotting to take over the world. Ah, <laughs> uh, you are some kind of snaky genius. <laughs> I never thought anyone put it together. Uh, I thought maybe they put me and Bobby. Maybe Hitler and Jack. But never Bobby, Jack, Hitler, and Elvis. <laughs> All four of us. What are the odds of that? Well, I know. The reason I know is because I'm in a parallel bunker. <laughs> well, holy <laughs> shit. <laughs> That's right. He said parallel bunker. <laughs> Unbelievable. Well, who's in there with? Well, I've got Jimmy Stewart and I. That's all. Just the two of us. 
Well then, now, we've been plotting to take over the world for the last 45 years. <laughs> well, bust my obviously ball. <laughs> Unbelievable. Yes, as a matter of fact, he's coming down the shaft right now. 